Hey guys, what's up? This is VibersNiber500, and I'm going to show how to make a Minecraft multiplayer server for 1.1 on a Mac. So, what you want to do is you want to go into Safari, and you want to go to Minecraft.net. I will have the links in the, the description. And right here, you want to go to Download. Then you want to get minecraftserver.jar, which is down here at the way bottom. And it will download that. Just minimize that. I have to do this. Just drag it out here. And let it load. I don't know why, it just has trouble loading some of these things sometimes. Oh yeah, right here I am going to upload this m multiplayer part 2, but it's like really long. And then with the Minecraft server.jar, you just want to have it out here. What you want to do is create a new folder. And you want to name it like Minecraft server or something like that. Haft server. Mine up here is just server. I have that one. But this is just an example. Then you just want to drag in the server.jar. Then you, all you'll have is this. So then what you want to do is you want to go to this will also be in the description this wiki page and it will automatically take you down to the right here to this code and what you want to do is highlight all of it it's kinda weird but just highlight all of it copy it minimize you're gonna need that for a later step and what you want to do is go up here and search text edit you know just type in text and why is it not up here? Oh, I put test. Text. Edit. There it is. And then you'll have text edit right here. So, then what you want to do is paste it. And then you want to say... Oh, wait, no. And when you paste it, you want to go up here to format and make plain text. Click OK. And then it should be in plain text. Then save it to your desktop and put it exactly like this start dot command this is so like you have the command to start up your server and just leave all this the same and then once it's right here then just drag it into your minecraft server and I'll put this pre-made one in the uh... description I guess yeah I'll do that let me just highlight this in orange there we go. And then what you what you're gonna do is open up terminal. You can go here and just type in terminal in the spotlight, which is way easier than going to applications and all that other crap. And so what you want to do in terminal is type in ch mod space a plus x space. And then what you want to do is go into your server drag in the start dot command and then press enter and that should give it the command to start up the server and then when you click on it you just want to cl double click the start dot command and let it load up and it'll say all this preparing spawn area you'll see failed to load all this other crap just let it load all the server and then when it says done go down here and click stop and enter and then let it save <clears throat> may take a minute since it's your first time so then just let it do that there we go and then you can just text out of this terminal and then you'll get all this stuff and what you want to do is go to server.properties and hold on mine didn't open up right then you want to go to open let it with mine doesn't have text edit for some reason and you just want to open with text edit and then when you open it up you'll have all this stuff allow nether pretty straightforward on that one name world just leave it like that I don't know what that is allow flight pretty straightforward leave this the same uh, level type default just leave that instead of the flat unless you do want flat I don't know what this is either. Level seed, you know, seeds. 
server IP. Now this is where what you're gonna have to do. Let me just exit out of that. You're gonna want to go back to Safari, and then I'll have this link. It's Hamachi, and you want to download this, the unmanaged version. And after you install all that, then you'll have it in your applications. But then you'll just have it, and then you'll want to power it on and what you're going to want to do is have a uh, make a what do you call it a account thing network create one if it doesn't tell you to make one but this used to be on my last computer so don't worry about that and uh... then here's your server IP right here this first part and then what you want to do is go into server properties then right here at server IP you want to type in that code and please don't try to join my server okay then once you have that code typed in then you're good pretty much PVP I like to turn that on false so people don't like that's where people can hit you and damage you difficulty one pretty simple. Game mode, if it's zero, then it's survival. One is uh, creative. Uh, max players, pretty straightforward. Spawn monsters, straightforward again. Generate structures, needs to do that so it can make dungeons and crap. View distance, straightforward, has the same. And that's pretty much it. Then you just want to save it. And there it is. Now, what you're going to want to do is this. Right here, We'll see. I'll start it up. Start up Minecraft, not system preferences. Pre yeah, pre preferences. Can't say that word. Let it prepare everything. And then you want to have Hamachi on too. Turn it on. Why is my Minecraft not loading? There it is. Okay. And once you get in here, then. I already have it right here. Then when you join it, hold on. What what is it doing? Okay, what's happening? Ah, oh, there we go. And then if you notice where you spawn, you can't destroy anything. So what you want to do? is go over to one of these and either go not right there you can either go to this one or this other one that I was just at but you can press you do OP and then you put in your name your minecraft name and then if I go back to minecraft you're now an OP so now I can destroy these blocks then I can do commands and crap but if you don't want to do it that way, then you can do it this way. Hold on, let me shut down the server. Stop. There we go. And you can go to OP, and then you can just type it, put in your name. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That's how you make a Minecraft server, and I'll have all the links in the description, and probably this. Uh, so you can... Uh, you're gonna have to watch this video to probably get the commands and start it up and all that crap. But yeah, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and comment. Guys, one more thing that I forgot to add: if your server is running like really slow, then what you want to do is go into your uh server folder and open up the right-click the start command and open with text edit. And then it should bring up this. And right here is a code for how much gigabytes of RAM it's going to use. But after, like, say you have the server running, then it's going to use the m many gigabytes of RAM. But once you get out of it, it's going to give you back the RAM. But how you figure out, it says a minimum of 1 gig and a maximum for 1 gig. But what you want to do is you want to go up to this Apple and say about this Mac and I installed 8 gigabytes of RAM in mine 
and this will make it run faster for everybody in server. So I would put in four in each of these. So I would be like backspace four, and I would do it in the other one too. Backspace four, and now I have four gigabytes of RAM. So that's all I needed to add. Sorry for not adding it. Now I'm done. Rate, comment, and subscribe.